you can do pull downs behind the neck or you can do them in the front. All the old school books I've read, all those guys are doing them in the back. I've done them in the back. That's half the reason how I've been able to get my body. If you don't do them in a safe environment, if you're not very aware of what you're doing, you can get hurt. Okay? Some of the exercise science guys are screaming, don't do this, and I agree with them if you can't do this. But if you can do it in an educated way and just follow, the, um, not advice, but a different option, then go ahead. So today we're going to show him how to do this, and, um, and I'm going to do a quick uh, example of it, and then once again, this is optional for you. If you're by yourself, how do I know if I'm square? I like to square up to this thing. So because this is on an angle, I'm just going to follow the angle. Now I'm going to sit down. My butt's literally leaned right up against this thing. Bap, so I'm square. Now because I've got this massive arch in my back, feel that arch? See it? It's like a bowl of soup. I'm not here, I'm here. And I can feel it pinching in my lower back. One. Two. Three. Where I felt that? Right there. Hard. You're not going to feel it. I'll see if I can do it better. If you don't get that bowl of soup, that. So I'm literally in this position. I'm not here. I'm not even here. I'm here. My very best to pull that in. Okay? That's what I talk about. When I say the bowl of soup, it's the same thing as here. Bowl of soup as opposed to here. That's flat. That's a bowl of soup. Whew. All right, show me what we got, buddy.